Welcome back to the channel, everyone. Today I'm going to do a really strange video, um, as you can see by the title. Um, I, uh, I am documenting a scam that I purposely got into. Yes. So, I, uh, I just kind of really wanted to see what would happen. So, let's go back to the beginning of the story. Um, so if you guys are familiar with Instagram, you can see that, uh, you know, every couple of posts when you're scrolling through your feed, you get an advertisement. Some of them are legit, some of them are not. Um, there are a lot of, unfortunately, a lot of scammers out there in the world now that, I don't know, this world has gotten so incredibly lazy that people would rather just scam money out of people who work really hard for it. And uh, that's what happens. But I really wanted to do this just to see what would happen and to show you guys. Um, and and like they always say, <laughs> if it's too good to be true, probably is. I was scrolling through Instagram one day and uh, I seen it before. And it was a, a Milwaukee toolbox, big old tool chest. And, you know, I... I knew it was a scam and I passed it up before and then uh, it came up again um, and this one it was a different one and I could not go back and find the original ad um, but here um, right on the screen right now um, that's an example of what I'm talking about and if you look at the top it says sponsored by Harbor Freight um, the the one I got I think it said sponsored by Wayfair. Um, when I clicked on the Shop Now link, it brought me to um, <laughs> a website that had Wayfair written all over it. Um, now, when you looked in the address bar, it's actually Forge. Uh, I got it right here. It was Forge Aheaded, like ED. Forge Ahead ED. Uh, so they try they try and make it look like a legitimate website but uh you know it could fool some people but like this this toolbox was like 79.99 and it's a 61 inch 18 drawer tool chest and uh i'm like yeah there's no way so what did i do i signed up for it i bought it and uh <laughs> i got a order number emailed to me and everything else and for a while there the link that they sent uh actually worked i could go back and check my order on the website and right away because i knew it was a scam it, it had a uh, contact customer service number and uh it's a pretty the 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 email address is pretty much a joke uh but i emailed them anyway and um basically told them that if this was a scam i wanted my money back um, if not, I expected my order to ship right away <laughs> just to see what they would say. You know what I mean? Never got a response. So I'm like, oh yeah, this, this probably isn't going to go anywhere. So I honestly, honestly forgot about it. And, uh, two weeks later I get this email and it says, uh, your order is on its way. I'm like, what, what order? I'd look it up and it's a stinking toolbox. Now, what's going through my head? Is it going to be the toolbox? No, definitely not. Uh, but there's a tracking number, so crazy. All right, so I'm just uh, showing you the email right here. This is the uh, email confirmation on the shipment that was shipped out. And it says uh, right here, you can track it with this tracking number here or track with uh, 17 track. So what happens when I click on that guy? And as you can see here for the tracking, um, it's out for delivery today. And that's why I wanted to make this video because I want to uh, want to open it today on camera and see actually what it is. Now, when I go to the USPS tracking here and look it up, it says it's a small package. So obviously, it is not a toolbox. So I'm really, really curious to see what's actually being delivered today. Maybe it's a note that says, hey dude, joke's on you, you're an idiot. Yeah, yeah, yep, I am. Definitely for doing this. For some reason, I just wanted to do it. 
let's uh, let's see what happens when it shows up here. All right, guys. Today is the day. It is the next day, and uh, here's my 61-inch toolbox. I've been feeling the package, and it's just I don't know. It's like a coin or something. It feels like it's really weird. I don't know why this is so stupid and exciting to me, but let's check out this thing, see what it is. <laughs> this is creepy, guys. Okay, this is what it is. It's a coin. On this side, it says yes. And <laughs> on this side... It says no. This is kind of creepy. Creepy as I'll get out. I don't think I want to like open it in the house. There's the no side. It's got like a, uh, I don't know. It's like a human skeleton with wings. And then this is the S side. A couple of hands with eyes in the palms. This is just weird creepy I'll uh cameras the GoPro is not picking it up real good so I'll take some pictures and put them on the screen right here <laughs> I don't know what to say um I I just always assumed with scams you didn't get anything it's really weird that they would send me this <laughs> you guys got any input let me know down below this is just kind of creeping me out a little bit. I'm not superstitious or anything, but uh, weird, just weird. It's got a phone number on the packaging and everything. At least they sent me something, right? All right, guys, like normal, didn't shoot an outro, so here's your outro. <laughs> and uh, the moral of the story is, just like everybody's parents told them, if it's too good to be true, it probably is. You know, every once in a while, you're going to get some good luck or whatever, and stuff that may seem too good to be true may just be true but in this case obviously i knew that i was signing up for a scam i was just really um curious i do stupid stuff so i'm like well why not continue to do stupid stuff and sign up for a scam and see what happens and then uh I'll show you guys but uh just be careful on instagram you know what i mean i've seen i've seen some cool stuff on there um and actually from ads gotten some pretty cool stuff. Rib Nuts was one of the best ads I seen on Instagram and I've used that thing and I love that thing. Um, so that <laughs> that worked out really good. This, no, not so much. But anyway, wasting you guys' time. Until we meet again, guys, later.